Hey what's up guys in this video we're going to talk about void pointer in C++ programming. Void pointer is a generic pointer and the void pointer is not associated to any data type. Thus it can hold the address of any data type. And the syntax of void pointer is first we have the void keyword then the asterisk sign and then the name of the void pointer. And then the void pointer can hold address of any data type variable and this way the void pointer will point to that variable and to access the content of the void pointer we cannot use the dereferencing operator we have to use the static cast operator and we have to convert the void pointer to one specific data type pointer and then we can use the dereferencing operator and we can access the content of that void pointer and also we can use the C style casting where we convert the void pointer to one specific data type pointer and then we can use the dereferencing operator and we can access the content of that void pointer. Like in this example program first of all we have created one void pointer ptr and then we have created one integer variable a with the initial value 10 and then we have assigned the address of variable a into that void pointer. So the void pointer will be pointing to the variable a and then to access the content of the void pointer we have to use the static casting to convert the void pointer to one integer type pointer and then we can use the dereferencing operator and we can access the content of the void pointer. So if we just save the program and run the program and you can see we have successfully accessed the content of the void pointer and similarly also we can use the C style casting where we can convert the void pointer to one integer type pointer and then we can use the dereferencing operator and we can access the content of that void pointer. So I'm gonna save the program and run the program again. And you can see the output is 10. So this is the way we can create one void pointer and the pointer can point to any data type variable. And then to access the content of the void pointer, either we can use the static casting and convert the void pointer to one specific type pointer or we can use the C style casting and convert the void pointer to one specific type pointer. And then we can use the dereferencing operator and we can access the content of that void pointer. So hope you understand the concept. We'll see you in the next one. Thank you.